Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in to today's Words of Wisdom. Today's was on November 22nd, and I quote, Knowing how to be content means loving your life and embracing it. From the Challenge of the Mind by Master Ryuho Okaba. Thank you, Lord God. All right, so if you've been studying here at Happy Science, uh, we've been taught how important it is learning to be content or having an it's enough mind, uh, meaning not having a greedy mind, uh, having a mind that's fulfilled and um, grateful for what we already have because that leads to a heavenly world and that leads to actually happiness that severs away a lot of the causes of or the roots of our sufferings and the pains we go through in life, which is not being able to get what we want. Uh, you, you don't have to, you can quench uh, that thirst of uh, greed, not by getting what you wanted, but actually changing your mindset to letting go of wanting and craving for things. So let's go back to today's words of wisdom. Uh, how do we then love our life and embrace it? Um, to be honest, you're just going to have to adopt a spiritual view of life. You have to. Uh, what I mean by this is you have to start up by thinking that your life is a gift given by God. Uh, your physical body and your souls are gifts given by Lord God, the Creator. Lord Alcantara has created us and given it to us and has allowed us to go through series of reincarnations and has allowed us, permitted us to be allowed in this, to be born in this specific situation in this life. Uh, there's a huge mercy and compassion behind our life that allows us to exist. Once we know this, we can be very grateful no matter how miserable your life is, how painful it may be, you start noticing that there's actually many bright, brighter sides to it. The brighter side of your life. You're actually given many, many more things than you thought. And then when you start thinking like you are truly loved by Lord God, El Cantare, it becomes like a one-to-one -one, one -one connection with Him. Uh, Lord God becomes feels so much closer to you. And you start feeling how much he loves you. If it's hard for you to love your life, try to see your life, try to see your soul from God or El Cantare's perspective. He loves you so dearly and he is always cheering us that we can overcome our pains and sufferings in life and that we will be able to live a very happy life just by awakening to this sentence. Uh, loving our life and embracing it. If it's hard seeing it from your perspective, let's try looking at it from God's perspective. I hope this becomes a hint for happiness. Thank you very much and see you again tomorrow.